The summer slaughter continues at Insert Scream here. Hey, I'm Ryan Turk, the managing editor of ShockTillYouDrop.com, and over the next few months, I'm looking at some of the best kills featured in the slasher genre. It's going to be tough to top episode 15's Orgy of Violence featured in The Burning, but in this installment, I'm pulling a scene from one of the greatest slasher franchises of all time, Friday the 13th. In Friday the 13th Part 3, released in 3D in 1982 and directed by Steve Miner, Jason Voorhees terrorizes a whole new set of teenagers outside of Crystal Lake. Two of the teenagers we're introduced to in the film are Debbie and Andy, and by far, they're the setup for the best kill in this film. The two have just finished making sweet lovin' in a hammock, and Andy has offered to get Debbie a beer. Minor begins the scene with a false scare as Andy startles Debbie in the shower. Do you want a beer or not? <laughs> sure. All right, be right back. Okay. Somewhat of a show-off, or maybe just a weirdo, Andy begins walking on his hands and goes to get that beer. What he doesn't know is Jason is waiting for him and that walking on your hands is probably the dumbest and least safe thing to do around a killer with machete ever. I love the almost humorous composition of the shot in which you can see Jason's legs and machete just at the side of the frame as our attention is drawn to Andy walking down the hallway before he experiences one of the most brutal kills in the series. After dispensing with Andy, Jason goes after Debbie, but the kill isn't all that memorable. Do you have a favorite moment from Friday the 13th Part 3? Discuss it in our comment boards below and I'll see you guys next time.